Long roads in the city of Muskegon continues, especially since this weekend those piles are expected to begin melting. 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills has more now on the city's message to people who park on city streets. Well, city leaders spent about one month telling residents about the new seasonal parking ordinance. They even passed out thousands of these information cards. Now they're going to start replacing the cards with actual tickets. Tim Malaki is thankful for warmer temperatures. Today we finally got a little bit of sun. And he's ending the week on a mission. We want to try to get this cleaned up as much as possible. But vehicles in violation of the city's seasonal parking ordinance slow him down. Makes it real difficult for even uh, normal traffic get up and down the roads. On streets with parking on both sides of the street, residents can park vehicles on the side of the street with even numbered addresses on even numbered calendar days from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. On odd calendar days, residents park on the side of the street with odd numbered addresses again from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. Parking is allowed on both sides of the street between the hours of 5 p.m. and 7 a.m. Our goal is not to write um, tickets. Our goal has been to maintain our streets in the most efficient and effective way we can, and I think it's working. Muskegon Public Safety Director Jeffrey Lewis says if everyone complies, residents will see the results. After a couple, three days, the street becomes clean on from curb to curb. On streets where parking is allowed on just one side of the street, vehicles must leave those spaces between the hours of 2 a.m and 6 a.m. I think the word's getting out. For weeks, these information cards were left on vehicles in violation of the ordinance. Now the city is transitioning from informing to enforcing. Usually we switch January 1st to enforcing. This year we've waited till February 1st. And if you'd like to read or print off the full seasonal parking ordinance, you can find it included in this story on our website, 13onyourside.com. In Muskegon, John Mills, 13 on your side.